Hello guys, welcome back to Tech Trick Tutorial. In today's video, I will show you how to fix Bluetooth on Windows 11 Get Connect. Let's get started. Currently on our laptop and this is our Windows 11. And the different things that you could do to try and diagnose the issue is that you could try connecting your device that you're trying to connect, your Bluetooth device that you're trying to connect on another device first to ensure that that device that you're trying to connect is not the issue itself. Sometimes we're trying to connect something on our computer and we just forgot or we just don't know that the issue itself is the device that we're trying to connect and not our computer. But if it is working, it is most likely an issue with your own device or your laptop. So what we could do is we could go to our Bluetooth settings over here. Uh, sometimes we could click on a device over here and manually allow us to or to try and force it to connect through this method over here. Also, ensure that your computer or your device that you're trying to connect is not already connected to another device because of course some device does not support multiple connections there are some device that allows you to connect two devices at the same time but some does not want that and could only connect the one so maybe you're trying to connect your headset let's say headset as an example to your computer but it is already connected to another device and you think the issue is on your computer but it really is on uh, the fact that your headset is already connected to another device so ensure that uh, all devices around you has their bluetooth turned off uh, check your phone uh, you could check and tell your the other people around you to turn off your bluetooth and try once again if it will work uh, make sure that you reset though your bluetooth device like turn it on and off and turn on the pair mode and try again uh, what you could also do if it has previously already connected on your device or your laptop and it stopped working what you could do is you could forget that specific uh, device or remove device over here uh, so that it could uh, have a reset of the connection so we could view our devices over here uh, so over here let's say we don't like indie anymore you could remove that uh, if you want, if you don't like that device to be connected anymore, as you can see. Uh, we could also uh, check out our Bluetooth settings over here. As you can see here, you could also click on allow Bluetooth device to find this PC. Maybe the device that you are trying to connect to, uh, it can be recognized by your PC, but the device itself does not recognize your PC, so there's like a conflict of connection where it wants to connect but at the same time it does not want to connect with your PC so allow this also over here uh, for the meantime as you can see also make sure that the notification is on uh, there's also other hardware that you can check over here as you can see click on properties and you can check if the device is working properly as you can see it will say under your uh, device status if your Bluetooth USB module is working properly sometimes our Bluetooth itself is having issues like a hardware issues and you can also check out your drivers so what we could actually do another thing is we could open our control panel and navigate to hardware and sounds uh, as you can see here and then over here click on device and printers uh, look for device manager and this will show us all the device that is connected or all the hardware on our PC and believe it or not Bluetooth is actually a hardware as you can see same thing with what we saw earlier it is a module it's a hardware somewhere on your laptop that is allowing it to receive Bluetooth so that you could do some connections so over here, simply select your Bluetooth over here and what you're going to do is you're going to right click it so that you can see the update driver option. And then you could also, uh, uh, let's see, let's click this and what you can do is you can click on search automatically for drivers which will search the internet if 
uh, there's a new driver available for your uh, Bluetooth. So because sometimes uh, an up, an updated module is going to do some conflicts with your device and it won't really allow you to connect if your module is not updated because sometimes uh, there's some requirements with the version of Bluetooth to connect with the newer devices nowadays. Now let's exit that. You can also check out our properties over here and check all the other information available over here as well. You can check them out. And another thing that you could do is you could try and disable the device. You can disable this, uh, which will basically disable a Bluetooth on your laptop for a few moments or like a short time and try to enable it again, the good old turn it off and on method, which will basically reset the entire Bluetooth module. And maybe that could work as well. Uh, what we could do is another thing we could do is we could do to the same thing that we saw earlier in this section. Uh, you could try connecting another device first. If it's uh, same logic as earlier, where it's a headset, if the headset that you're using or trying to use is not working, but another headset is working, that once again implies that there is a compatibility issue with your device your laptop and your Bluetooth device, the headset itself is not really working together and there's going to be some issues uh, with your connection. I could also research if your device actually supports the connection or like the minimum requirement of the Bluetooth version for your device that you're trying to connect is compatible with our computer. Another thing that you could try and do is to go and search up NVIDIA or AMD over here and get some driver updates for your processor and graphics, all of those things. Update your graphics or your drivers to ensure that all drivers on your computer are updated because maybe an unupdated uh, driver is causing some compatibility issues with your other drivers, not allowing you to do or establish a connection between your Bluetooth and your device. Uh, we could also search or we could also do uh, update through our terminal by simply opening our Windows terminal over here, the terminal admin, and inputting this command, which will basically update all the known drivers on your computer so that or to ensure that all devices that you are using or drivers are updated. And uh, keep trying and restart your computer for every step that you do because maybe a uh, restart is all it needs. So basically that's it guys. If you enjoyed this video, leave a like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.